Hello, Medit users. Welcome to Medit Apps 1.1 Developer Update video. My name is Maria and I'm a product manager here at Medit. So in this video, I will be revealing all the cool new functions that we added in Medit Smile Design and Medit Orpha Simulation 1.1. But before I do so, let me just express our deepest gratitude for all of you who downloaded the apps, welcomed them into your workflow and also provided us with a lot of great feedback. This, once again, has proved the strength of our Medit community. So let me walk you through the recent updates and all the highlights of them. Some of you who are super active in our Medit user Facebook group might even recognize some of these features as your own suggestions. You guys loved Orpheus simulations so much. So what we did this time is that we tried to expand the functionality of the program to make you the master of your own workflow. Before you could only simulate the teeth moving trajectory for all teeth at the same time, but now you'll be able to choose which parts you'd like to adjust manually. As usual, create multiple scenarios, but now one can be all automatic one, one can be totally manual, and one can have specific teeth moving only. You can now set missing teeth as the ones that will have implants and proceed with the simulation. The program will automatically create a tooth in that empty space, so it's easier for you and your patient to imagine how the treatment will go. Another thing we worked on is to make the adjustment process easier and much more flexible. Now you can move teeth not just one by one, but several at the same time. You can also watch the movement simulation for the chosen teeth only. Looks pretty cool, huh? We also added the green view option so you can check out the size of the model. What we also did is that we added this feature to separate animation into number of stages that also can be exported one by one. And drum roll please, you can now export segmented teeth into MeditLink. You didn't give us much justification about why you want to do this, but we still did. So enjoy! In Smile Design, we focus on providing some cool new functions for you to step up your consultation game. So first of all, so many of you asked to provide a rotation tool, so of course we did. My favorite addition to Smile Design this time is Texture Library. You have a restoration library you're proud of? Use it! We'll export the texture for you so that you can utilize it for consulting your patients. Don't have those images? Also, no problem, go to this link and check out if other users have uploaded something to share with the Medit community. We love some magic here at Medit, so we're introducing the texture wizard. This wizard will automatically create a texture that matches the texture and shade on the image. Way to impress your patient. Great news for you, masters of orthodontics. We added a braces simulation feature, which helps your patients to make sure that they will still look beautiful during the treatment. Choose it between a metal and a ceramic option, choose the elastics color and you're good to go. Another thing we improved is preview. Now you'll be able to compare any of the simulation options you worked on in those windows. Want to show your patient how they would look like with ceramic or metal braces? We have you covered! So there it is, all the important highlights for our 1.1 updates for MediSmile Design and Medit Orphis Simulation. What we're trying to do is to improve our consultation tools so that your patients feel much more confident and so do you. If you know us pretty well, you will know that this is just the beginning of Medit Apps and we have so many more surprises that come this year. If you're new to Medit community, I would like you to know that we never fail to bring you what you want. So this is it and see you next time. Bye bye.